Hey YouTube, it's Mixed Native Beauty and I'm here to do a makeup tutorial finally. I know, I just have a lot of difficulties with this camera and I'm going to attempt to do it one more time. If it doesn't work, ouch, hot lamp. I don't know what I'm going to do, but I'm totally bare. But I'm going to attempt to do it. But um, yeah. So stay tuned and watch and cross your fingers. All right, bye. <laughs> Okay, now I'm taking my Mary Kay foundation primer and I'm rubbing it all over my face. It's a gel-like substance which it disappears as you apply. Then I apply my Bronze One Mary Kay concealer using my MAC foundation brush. It's the 150. You can use any foundation brush. I just put a little dab on each under eyelid. Then I blend with my brush. And this bronze one is actually, it looks really light, but once you blend it, it's, it's very good for you. It's very good. Because the bronze two was too dark. It was like chocolate. But once you blend out the bronze one, it's perfect. Then I apply my Mary Kay Time Wise Luminous Wear Foundation. It's the new foundation from Mary Kay. I actually like it better than the medium coverage because it has this dewy, natural looking is glow and I love it I blend it all throughout my face apply it to my hand so I can warm up and then blend on the brush then I apply my Mary Kay loose powder in bronze one it's a silky loose powder and I apply it to my top of my lid take a little bit from my foundation brush apply it under my eyes to conceal the concealer so it wasn't doesn't get creasy and this loose powder actually compares to the MAC skin finish powder which the MAC is a little bit more matte but they work just about the same and the Mary Kay one is cheaper then I apply it all to my face voila <laughs> Then I go to my Mary Kay Compact, it's my favorite compact because I can put three shadows, blush, brushes, and lip gloss or lipstick or any powder. Then I apply my blush in Golden Copper. It's a, I wouldn't say orange, but it's a brown, I mean it's Golden Copper. Explains itself, I can't explain the color, but it's Golden Copper. I apply it to my cheeks. And then I apply my bronzing powder in Desert Sun, which is a shimmer, not a, not a coloring bronzer. It's more of a shimmer. I apply it under my, above my cheek blush. <laughs> and there was a song on. It was Katy Perry. <laughs> fireworks, or, yeah, fireworks. <laughs> Firework. I'm debating if I should put on eyeliner or not. So I do apply my Mary Kay eyeliner in black. I apply it to the middle of my lid first and gently stroke close to the eyelid. I mean, close to the eyelash line. <laughs> and I take it forward near my tear duct and just apply right above the eyelash line. Then I will go over it again so it can be darker and so that it could dry, the first layer can dry. Do the same to the second eyelid. Then I wing it out. As you can see where I stopped at the first line, then I just take a wing out from the bottom and then combine them and fill it in. Very simple. Takes practice. Do the same to the other eye. Create that triangle shape. Then I apply my Mary Kay mascara, the ultimate mascara, in black. I apply 
above my lash line first and then I go underneath and apply the regular way. This helps get the lashes coated very well and blended. Then I'm going to apply it to the bottom of my lash line as well. Voila! <laughs> the last step is my Mary Kay lip gloss, the Nourish Shine lip gloss. It's in Gold Rush. It's a very high pigment glow gold. <laughs> it's very pretty, as you can see. It's illuminous. Oh, then I forgot. <laughs> Well, I didn't forget, but my camera didn't catch me doing my eyebrows, so I'm going to go through and explain how I did the eyebrows. I first brush it with the eyebrow brush, brush the lash, the not lashes, the eyebrow hairs. Then I take my MAC eyebrow pencil, and it's the spike, which is like a dark brown, blackish brown, but it's brown. That actually was my older one. It was empty, but I could still use it, for example. I basically just take, I basically just outline how I want my brows to look. I outline the top part of my brow, and I outline the bottom. It's a straight line. Not too soft, not too harsh, just a line. Once I line the top and bottom of my brow, how I want them to be, I slowly fill them in from the very tip, stroke by stroke. Don't go too harsh, you don't want like super dark brows and I fill them in just a little darker towards the middle and I slowly go towards the front and kind of just wing it out and create a square type shape and just fill it in. Hey this is my finished look using my Mary Kay and just one MAC product. Thanks for watching. Check out my blog, genuineromantic.thumbler.com. I'll put the link underneath and check out marykay.com slash Candice Murray. If you see any products you like or want to get, go ahead and put it to the basket. It's no cost and I will get it to you. Alright, bye bye.